yes. Um, yeah, the whole band and I were all um, we're all candy freaks. And uh, but one of the main main things that I feel like I'm addicted to and I have been for years is peanut M Ms. I always ask for them on the rider. Um, you know, I even got it got bad a few years ago. Like I would just you know, two in the morning, I was like, I need M&M's, and I would drive out to get M&M's at a store, just eat them all night. I was obsessed with them. I think there's something in them that's addictive, worse than cigarettes. Wow, that's, that's a really interesting, I've never been asked that question, which is a good one. Um, I mean, you would have to get the, have to get the good guys. You'd have, you'd have Leatherface in the band, gotta have Freddy Krueger. I think Freddy Krueger would, would be perfect for vocals because he always had the best one-liners. He's always already got a hat. You know, he's got a cool voice. So I would put Freddie as the lead singer. You would have Leatherface, Michael Myers, Jason. This is the ultimate band. This is a cool idea. I don't know how many shows they would get through before they killed each other, but uh, but that would be my super group right there, all those guys. Yes, I'm actually uh, in the works with one right now. I have a, I'm, uh, I've been asked for years because of Rob Zombie doing movies, which I'm a big fan of. All the stuff he does, his music and his movies as well. I thought how so, and... Devil's Rejects were just great movies. Really liked Devil's Rejects a lot. And uh, but ever since he's did movies, you know, I've been asked, "When are you going to do a movie?" And I'm like, "I, I don't know." But uh, actually, the title of our new record, "The Dixie Dead," uh, is a movie title I'm working on as well. Because the song "The Dixie Dead," if you re read the lyrics of that, you can get an idea what this movie's about. But I'm basically going to try to get back to North Carolina and um, film a uh, horror movie later this year called "The Dixie Dead," and uh, it's just going to be a Southern fried hillbilly zombie movie through my eyes. And uh, I'm excited about this one. I've never made a movie before. I keep telling people I don't, it's either gonna be really good or really bad good. <laughs> I mean, I'm not superstitious at all or any, any means, but uh, it's definitely cool when, when uh, you know, which is ironic that my name falls into a day, of the, a day of the week. And then, you know, actually this year, there's three Wednesday the 13th, so it's pretty cool. And uh, we did one in, at the, in Hollywood at the Whiskey A Go-Go in February. And, now we're doing a Wednesday the Thirteenth show in London, so I think it'll be a little different tonight. I mean, it's it always adds a little. It's like when you play on Halloween; it's just an extra ambience in the air, and it just makes it feel like you can't go wrong. So, uh, so yeah, I'm excited about it. But as far as being superstitious or anything about it, no.